run a lot in you know, high school and kind of figured out that I wanted to run at the collegiate level and uh, kind of looked at a couple different schools, but really uh, loved the kind of um, community here at, at CCU, loved the team, um, really um, liked Coach Pogue and uh, thought that he had a lot of cool plans for you know the future of the team. They weren't a very um, competitive team when I joined and um, still wasn't for a couple of years, but uh, there's yeah, a couple of guys that I came in with and you know along with um, some of the older guys really uh, talked a lot about how to grow the program, how to get you know to that top um, ourselves and top of the NCAA, top of the RMAC. So that's kind of how I got to CCU. I thought that it was a, a vision that um, I could buy into and believe in. And so that's, uh, that's how I got to CCU. And then since then, um, really it's just been uh, a long time, a couple of years of just, yeah, really dedicate myself to the process that Coach Pogue has for the team. Um, and just uh, yeah, letting that kind of unfold. I'd say the success wasn't very immediate in uh, my own career, but I started um, kind of competing at the national level eventually. And um, it was funny, I was thinking about the, um, this weekend, how my freshman year, uh, I was a couple guys out of making the RMAC meet. Um, and I went to the RMAC meet, and just, you know, was there as a freshman, 18 year old, just like dreaming of what it would be like to compete um, at just at the RMAC championships and how cool that would be to eventually be there. And, um, yeah, so I think that that's kind of where it started and then um, eventually made a couple national championships. The team made our first national championship in 2019 um, as a cross country team. And, um, and then I've been able to compete a few times at the national stage and track as well. And, um, yeah, it's been really, uh, really fun and yeah, cool to see the team grow in that way. I'd say the mindset was just to really challenge myself and, and push you know, to, to my absolute limit. Um, a week previous to these races, I raced out in Boston. Um, it was kind of my first race back uh, after a long hiatus of racing, and um, I'd say it went it went pretty well. But I was disappointed walking away from the race um, how I challenged myself mentally, and I felt like I was a little bit weak on that front. And so that was the big goal and kind of mindset going into these two races: is no matter what result it brought, I really just wanted to um, just challenge myself and you know so show myself that I could push to that absolute limit. Um, and uh, yeah, get there because I don't think I was there a week ago in Boston, so that was the goal. Yeah, I'd say that it was it was pretty challenging. It, it definitely it's one of those feelings after a race you always want to kind of relax and you know let your guard down. You know, have a you know, cheeseburger and a soda and you know enjoy the success. But it it kind of was that vibe of finished up. It's like okay, well you know job's not done for the weekend. Still need to you know, keep at it. So. It was really, I'd say, right after the 3K, the, the whole mindset was just about recovery and getting ready for the next day, um, getting a full night's of sleep, um, you know, getting a ton of rest, and then uh, getting back at it the next day. And um, Honestly, I, I was surprised and um, happy with how well my body came back. It didn't feel like I woke up with any soreness or anything from the 3K, which was good. So, yeah, I mean, it, it seems crazy, but at the same time, we run every day. Um, really all year long. And so uh, the, the body's pretty used to recovering and, and coming back from a hard day of training. Yeah, um, I'd say last season, um, just to you know make the most of it. Uh, I think you know, CCU, we, we've had a, a lot of really great results at the national level and um, you know, a lot of recently. And I think that uh, myself and along, along with a lot of teammates have the chance to um, continue that success and you know, just bring home more accolades to the school and uh, just you know, represent CC well at the national level. So I'd say that's that's the goal, you know, all the same as it has been years in the past, just competing at the best, the best that we can and representing CC well.